hello everybody and welcome back to my channel so today i thought i would come on here and do a little bit of a different video thought i would talk about my tattoo experiences talk about the pain how much everything costs where i got them done who i got them done by by the way if you can hear um anything in the background it's just the fan because it's boiling hot. I have gotten every single one of them done at the same place and that is Queen of Hearts um, Wangaratta. If you're wondering where the hell is Wangaratta, it is in Australia. It is just a little town. I have gotten them done from like three different artists. So the first one I'm going to keep real simple is the one on my wrist and this one is, uh, it says family. The meaning behind this tattoo is because I just love family. I'm a very family orientated girl. Family means a lot to me. So see the script. My pa actually wrote that like in the font and I got them to like copy it and like, you know, stencil it on me and tattoo it. And some really cool fancy writing. I like it too because it looks a bit like old school. Didn't really hurt. The pain tolerance of this one, it didn't hurt. I literally sat through it and I was like, cool. When she went over it a second time, it kind of hurt, but like it still was bearable. That pain was probably like not even a five out of 10, probably a four out of 10. Next tattoo I'm going to talk about um, is the one on my forearm. Now this is a, a rose and it has initials here. Wondering what the initials are. It is CHLH, which is the initials of my great grandparents. So that is for them because I've always loved them. I haven't really like, you know, like, what's the word? I haven't really gotten over their death, even though it was probably about like, 10 years ago. That one was the first one I have ever gotten to. That, that was my first ever tattoo. And for the first ever tattoo, that's a pretty big. I always get compliments on it and how nice it is and how pretty it is and how elegant it is. That tattoo cost about $50. I was super nervous about getting that one, obviously because it was like my first tattoo. And he like, you know, when they're like, oh, I'm just gonna start now. When he started to do that, that little line I was like oh really is that it um the pain wasn't even that bad I could have fallen asleep to be honest um I, I think I nearly did so after the first one I got pretty addicted to getting tattooed and um, this person's name was Lee YT um he's not there anymore but he's the one who did this one shame that he moved because I wanted to keep like going back to him but he's still in Wangaratta I'm pretty sure but just had a different tattoo shop so the next one is on my ribs this one was done by Donna who is at the same place I don't know it's like not it's probably my least favorite one I don't know if I like it in a nice way like I'm not saying it's bad I'm not saying she did a horrible job I'm just saying I don't know if I like it the pain on that one ugh. and it was very bearable but like it was on the ribs it was on the bone it hurt I probably would rate it maybe a 6.8 7 oh, I'm just gonna rate it a 7 out of 10 this one was $50 $50 because she was an apprentice when it started so that like, she was trying to you know get clients in so she could practice I'm not saying she did a horrible job I'm just saying I don't know if I like it okay okay so the next one is gonna be very hard to show this is my star sign and like for Aquarius and I got this done with my best friend Katie she got her star sign too, which is Gemini, I'm pretty sure. And literally, it took, <laughs> probably took two minutes to do. Like, you know, it's just two, two little squiggly lines that have very good meaning. The meaning behind this one is it is my star sign, obviously. Comment below if you're an Aquarian. It didn't even hurt. Like, it was more of like a pin pinchy feeling that you get, like, 
and some on Pinterest here. Um, that one together because I got this one and the one on like the Aquarius one done at the same time. Together those two were fifty dollars. Now fifty dollars. Okay, so the last tattoo is on my foot and this is what it looks like. This I hope you can see. Can you see? Mind my toenails, I've just taken off my shellac. <laughs> I'm gonna try and hide them. I don't know why I got this, I just really like the design. I like the Mandela type, you know, print. There's no meaning behind that. Um, let's talk about the pain, shall we? <gasps> the pain. This one was the worst one out of all of them. My best friend Maddie went with me and she was trying her hardest not to laugh because I was in so much pain. Like, I was clenching the back of my calf as if it was a stress but I'm not exaggerating okay it actually really did hurt more than my other I got that one done by a lady named Savannah I think she's an American artist and that oh that is all the tattoos that I have on my body I really would like to get a leg piece done I really love to get like a rose piece I would love to get something to do with a tiger as well like maybe on like the back of my arm or something because tigers are my favorite animals if I was ever to die I would love to reincarnate to a tiger that is the end of my tattoo video showing you guys what my tattoos are, my experiences, my pain. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a massive thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!